Hello YouTube, it's the Duty Air Show. Let's go to part 19. In the last part, we killed the boss! Yes! And we finally finished this dungeon. Adam, you're up. Am I? Yes. What have I done now? That's the end, end of the first dungeon. Time for some voice acting. No, bloody hell. It's not that uh, Ari, uh, the, the, the guy with the... No, it's a princess. <laughs> uh, I mean, a sage. A, a sage? A sage princess? A daughter of the seven wise men. Not, not, not that good at female voices. So you're gonna get my own voice. Link! Because of you I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. This world used to be the Golden Land, where the Triforce was hidden. But because of Ganon, the boss of thieves, wished it the, the world was transformed. Boss of thieves? Ganon's a boss of thieves? I thought it was just a twat. <laughs> Uh, what does he actually face me? Place to get tried up your ass and um, ass and kill you. And stick and stick me a blue swirly, what looks like a safe point from to the original Tomb Raider game. <laughs> okay, carry on. Next page. I'm sure he's intending to to conquer even our light world after building his power here. Yeah, great. He can't exactly do it in half power. He needs to collect enough Jewel cells. Yes, he's not a pig, really. He's just a giant Duracell bunny. <laughs> he's trying to open a larger gate between the worlds near the castle using our powers. But the gate is not open completely yet. Yeah, he, he left his pry bar at home. Left his what? You know, he's got a piece of wood that keeps the gate open, but every time he puts it there, the piece of wood snaps because he can't fit food because he's too fat because he's a pig. Yeah, crowbar. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> If we seven maidens come... Come what? There will be much rejoicing. If we seven maidens come together, there will be very much rejoicing. <laughs> we can break the barrier around Ganon's hiding place. I will tell you where the other girls are held. I believe you will destroy Ganon. Well, at least someone's got some faith in me. Yeah, yeah. I don't have any faith in you whatsoever, mate. I will return to my original form at that time. Until then, I shall be a blue crystal, about three times your size. So you'll never, you'll never be able to carry me. Do you understand? Uh, sort of. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. Doesn't have the doesn't have the uh, the same ring as may the force be with you. Alright, Adam, could you pause the camera whilst I do some off screening side questing and uh, a little bit of um, fairy grinding? Fairy grinding, that sounds so <laughs> wrong on so many <laughs> levels. Go on, pause the camera, Adam. Oh, bloody hell, I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight, am I? <laughs> the nightmares! I need, I need more fairies, I wasted them all the last boss. <laughs> <laughs> okay, YouTube, after beating the first dungeon from the Dark Rose, start from the top of the pyramid. Which is in the centre of the world map where Ganon's, where Zelda's castle used to be. And head down the pyramid. He thinks he's found a heart piece. No, I definitely have I did I looked for it off screen. And I also died. For real this time, I got an actual game over. Yep. Because he's... He used all his fairies up on the last boss. And, and Went out and bought some potions, but never drank any. Is that right. got a padded spear? You see these blue um, nipple shaped things? Hit them with your hammer and they'll. Become even more realistic become... nipple shaped things. <laughs> they become outer belly buttons, they're inner belly buttons. They oh. drop down into Dark Lake, Hylia. Are you an outer or an inny? Um, Watch out for this um, flying thing here. Because it beats the shit out of you by looks. <laughs> Use your magic mirror here. You got low on health, mate, and no fairies, so be very careful. And then Watch grab out this shit. and your heart will increase. We now have, I think, ten hearts. Oh, yeah. Sh kill shit, pick away this bush, and double back to the light world. And then pause the camera I do some exploring. And hopefully less dying. And then can you keep your eyes on the camera? Yeah, sure. Right. From where you got your heart piece, teleport back into the dark realm using the um, thing that you got it in the first place. Then swim like hell. Because these things will kill you. K 
kill you. If you're lucky. They'll do worse Unspeakable th things to your backside. <laughs> Adam! We apologise for this, uh, for this um, person who making obscure references to people's bottoms in this video. Obscure references to people's bottoms, that doesn't sound right. No, it doesn't, but accurate. Swim. Wrong on so many levels, get but accurate. This, get out of this water as soon as possible and make your way up here. Leg it! Kill the tentacle monster. We're going to the second dungeon now. Past that two. guy with a padded spear! I swear those those spears are padded, look! He's, he's attacking you with a drumstick. <laughs> right, you two, we're going to get onto the second dungeon of the Dark Realm now. Because I was hoping it was a double magic meter, but we have giant boulders and um, a river in our way, so we can't... Apparently we need some kind of hook shot or titan's glove or whatever the hell he, what the hell, hell he was on about earlier. Right. After knocking down those blue things, head left. Don't walk into the cyclops. The cyclops. Um, this shot will be important later on. This is Link's house in the Dark World realm. It has now been turned into a bomb shop. <laughs> um, that will be very important later on if you manage to run out of bombs. I'd also like to point out he's um, Good out, incre yeah. increased his number of arrows since he turned it up. Yeah, I increased my arrows to 50 required, plenty of rupees. I bombed this thing as you get. Oops. You get stabbed. It's a dude. Take some rupees. Yeah! Hey! Just walk into walk into a cave and some guy said, "Here, take some rupees. Have my money." Cheers, mate. <laughs> okay, I'll have your money. Why does that work in real life? <laughs> hey, down here. Just walk into a random cave and some douche comes like, "Here, have my wallet." It's all right. <laughs> well, if you go to a country where money is always fake, I think mean, you might need to get that lucky item. All right. Yeah, but. What you just picked up isn't fake. I know. Right, let's start a second dungeon. But before you start a dungeon, YouTube, <laughs> head outside. You must do this. Use your magic mirror. Then head back inside in the light world. Push these boulders aside. I've already been here. Yep. Release the water. Look at that, was just stupid. <laughs> oh, I'll be fine. I've got several potions, I'll be fine. As long as you remember to use them. Teleport back to the Dark Realm. And you notice the water's been drained. Yeah. Now, go back in here. And here, Pesto, we have water. And that helps us out. It helps a lot. Exploring this dungeon without the water is impossible. I would have re read that, but uh, he didn't let me. <laughs> it is just shalahasha shasha 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 it's that thing from the abyss. Um, this dungeon is called the Swamp Palace. It's very similar to the Water Temple of Ocarina of Time, in my opinion, because it's rather confusing. But you know what really bothers me? How are there fireballs in a water temple? It's a turret. I bomb this wall. Ow. <laughs> It was like hit by a fireball, or I'd get a bomb to the face. It was basically choose my poison. That is your map. You got a map. We'll have to get onto the rest of this dungeon in the next part, because uh, we're on nine, nine and a half minutes. Alright. See you next time, YouTube. Bye.